Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for taking the time out of your day and checking out this video. This video is going to be an Aldi Valentine's Day candle haul. I saw these in their ad and I knew that I had to try and get them because I failed at getting the Halloween ones, which were really, really adorable. I saw that they had these and I said, girl, get your booty to the store. We have got to get them. So I picked up a couple of really adorable packaging and pretty good smelling candles. So let's get into it. I'll start off with my favorite, the one that I got two of. And I honestly, I should have gotten a third. I'm kind of kicking myself for not getting a third because I'm going to burn this in the living and dining room for February, but I kind of want one for my bedroom. So I think that these will be gone the next, by the next time I go grocery shopping, but it, it is what it is. I mean, these are so like stunning they come with this heart embossed lid the lids are very fingerprint prone but that's okay because you just wipe it down but i mean so cute this was the only scent that i saw had these lids so at least that's what i noticed but anyway look at this wrap around packaging like are you kidding it's it's so cute it's stunning it's Wide really nicely. I love the colors. I even love that they put one right above the name. I just think it's so adorable. I It's just, it's so cute. And these bad boys got some colored wax. Are you kidding me, Aldi? For $3.99, you're giving me a cute lid, cute packaging, and a colored wax. Woo. I'm just saying, we got some competition for another brand that looks very similar to this. Anyway, um, some of them were looking a little rough. As you can see, this one has some gouges taken out of it. A couple of other ones were looking a little dirty or a little just, they were just a little busted on the inside. But I got some pretty good ones. This one does have a, like a broken wick. This one's not nearly as long, but that's okay. Not a big deal. And the scent, it's so nice. I'm trying to pinpoint... It does not necessarily smell like a macaron or a macaroon. I'm just going to say macaroon. It's easier. I know it says macaron. And it doesn't really smell necessarily like pink sugar, but it smells sweet. Maybe even like a little bit of strawberry in here with a underlying some sort of cookie bakery type note. It's not very, very super gourmand and super super heavy bakery it's not like that but it's also not super super fruity it's a really it's a really great blend of it it, it honestly is mm. i i like this a lot i really do i feel like this is perfect for february I, i'm getting strawberry maybe that's just in my head because it's all pink and red and i think it should be strawberry but I really like it. I do. Not crazy, crazy strong on cold. But what I get, I really love. I really, really do. So pink sugar macaron. I love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. I'm wishing I would have gotten more of that. The next one that I have is the XOXO. Plain lid on this one. But this packaging is so adorable. Look at that in the corner. Ugh. Again, wrap around. Love this cherry red. I mean, these are just like, these are going to be staple pieces. I'm probably going to keep these and decorate with them even after Valentine's, like for next Valentine's Day, because these are gorgeous. And I don't remember if this one, oh my gosh, it's hard to, it's hard to get open. Oh yeah, this one does have a colored wax, red. This one is fruity with something else in there. Maybe the, mm, mm, Maybe a tidbit of like a musk, but it's not straight fruit. It's it's interesting. It's very different. I never I don't really own anything quite like this, and I also can't pinpoint the specific type of fruit, but I do know that it is fruity. Maybe some pineapple, or that's the first thing that comes to mind when I smell it is pineapple. Yeah, pineapple and like maybe a little bit of musk or something. Pineapple, strawberry, apple. I don't know. That's like a fruit cocktail. It honestly smells like a fruit cocktail. Just a medley of fruits. So this one's really nice. I'm going to burn this one in my bedroom because I only got one of them. Sorry for the lighting that it's dark. I'm just realizing how dark it is in here. It's very cloudy and overcast today, but 
<sighs> we're already here. Okay, last one that I picked up is this Be Mine, which is covered in these candy hearts. Pretty cute. Not my most favorite because these kind of look like vintage-y. I like the more brighter colors. Um, these are a little bit washed out with kind of a tan background or like a beige background. But I do think that it's cute with these little hearts in the corner. So plain lid again. And this one has like a baby pink wax. And this one, this one's really interesting. It almost smells like a man's cologne. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That smells like a very, very tame mahogany teak wood, ocean drift woody type of scents to compare it to Bath and Body Works. Yeah. I kind of, I like it though. This would be nice for a man cave or if you like those more sensual type of scents for the, ba um, the bedroom. You know, those sensual meaning like manly, deep, not floral, not foodie, not sweet. Yeah, this is great. This is very, very, it, I'm rubbing the wax and it's a little loose in there, but it's not a big deal. Yeah, very, very tame, but still men's cologne. -y. Definitely not nearly as strong as mahogany teak wood or an ocean drift wood, but it definitely has that um, cologne manny vibes. Let me smell this one again. Maybe this doesn't have musk. Maybe I'm lying. This is just very, very fruity. Fruity and maybe a little bit sweet. I really, really wish that Aldi put set notes out, even if it was just online. Like, I don't need them to be at the bottom. I just want I just want someone to tell me whether I'm right or wrong. Most of the time I'm wrong, but I just want to know what it is. It's definitely fruity, so if you like fruit, you'll like this one. These are 14 ounces, and they were $3.99 at Aldi. They had one more in the collection called Roses Are Red. I did, excuse me, I did smell that, but um, when I tell you straight rose, woo, it was straight rose. So if you feel like rose, you are going to love that scent because it is authentic. It is very, very strong, and it is just rose. There is nothing else in there. Um, and that one was, I think, black with red roses all over it. Very, very pretty. Again, not my type of scent. I don't really like florals especially, you know, when they're that strong. But if you love that, you got to get on it because these sell like hotcakes in the store. So honestly, I doubt that I will ever see these again. <laughs> My store is a Sunday store and I grocery shop on Sunday just by chance. And then I try not to go for the entire week because number one, I hate grocery shopping. And number two, you know, hello, pandemic. So I try not to go more than once a week. And then usually by the time that, you know, the following Sunday rolls around, all the good, really, really good stuff is already gone. So these were going to be gone. I think my store had probably five to six cases, meaning that I think their cases hold nine candles, five, six, nine, twelve, either nine or twelve. I can't quite remember. People post them online, but they're like, they're just like square boxes with dividers and then that hold the candles. So I got, uh, my store got five to six of them and only about one case was pretty much empty. Uh, no, maybe two cases. Cause I did have to, f well, I dug to find good pink sugar macaron. So definitely, excuse me, if you're going to go check your wicks, make sure that they're looking good. Cause like I said, you got to open these bad boys up, make sure that they're, you know, evenly spaced, that they're not too stubby and short and that they're, they don't look a, a mess coming out you know and going into your house so that is it you guys just some helpful little tidbits get to your stores your store is either going to be a Sunday or a Wednesday store it does say it at the bottom of your ads either that you get in the mail that you can look online you can pick it up in the store it will say you know either Sunday whatever the date is or Wednesday whatever the date is that is the date that these will be in your store so check it out if you're um if you're a Sunday store, they might still have some. I'm filming this on Monday. They might still have some. And if you're a Wednesday store, get there on Wednesday as soon as you possibly can. Because like I said, these things fly off the shelves. Because they're really cute. They're so affordable. I mean, $3.99 for 14 ounces of a three wick that just look adorable. And that now I can save for decor pieces. Love.
love, love, love. So let me know down below if you guys are going to get these or if you already have gotten them. I would love to chat with you guys. Thank you all so much for watching and I will see you in my next one. Bye.